Hi and hello Let's Play fans, it's your old pal Berg787 back with a brand new series. Brand new series of Sid Meier's Civilization V Brave New World and we're going to be playing on Deity once again. Now, those of you who watched the previous series, you would have seen me playing with Korea and coming ever so close, ever so close to winning. Would I lose by about a turn or two, two, three turns, something like that, from missing out on building the spaceship and, you know, if I want to look at things from a glass half full perspective... I came ever so close despite making a billion and one mistake, so if I can cut out a few of those mistakes, I can win the game. There you go. That's how that tells me I can win. If you want to look at it from a uh, sort of negative standpoint, which I don't really want to, but we'll address that anyway, I was playing with Korea, who were really good, and I still couldn't win, so hey ho. But I'm going to look at it positively. If I can cut out some of those mistakes, I should be there. I should be able to win. So what we've decided to do this time, or what I've decided to do this time, is play with China. Now, let's talk a little bit about them. China, uh, their great generals give you a combat bonus increase of 15%. So great generals in general, using general quite a lot, um, give you combat bonuses. Obviously, the Chinese version gives you an extra 15%, which is really good. Helps your troops be better. Uh, and they also spawn at 50% the increase rate, so you get them more often, which, again, more of them, more often, good times. Now, this is where things get really cool. They get the Chukonu is basically, I'm not going to call them the Chukonu because I'll just forget, I'll mispronounce it and stuff like that, so I'm going to call them Super Crossbowmen because that's basically what they are. If you have a look at the little read up there, they get to fire twice in one turn, that's almost like cheating if you ask me. So you're definitely going to want to get more, you know, archers, upgrade them to these guys and get them in general when they're available because they're super good and hopefully if they keep their, that shooting twice ability when they get upgraded to Gatling guns and so on and so forth, that's going to be really nice. But um, anyway, we'll see how that works out and finally, we get the Papermaker which... Which is, um, basically, it's, it's a library. It replaces the library, and it does what a library does. But it gives you also two gold per turn, which might not sound like a lot in the grand scheme of things, but at the time in the game when you build the library, two gold per turn is quite a lot. I mean, you could be earning, like, say, ten gold per turn at that stage. And, you know, an extra two gold per turn, that's like 20% increase in your economy, which is nothing to be sneezed at, that's for sure. So definitely want to get those. That's a nice little bonus early days. Um, we're going to be playing on Pangea, not Pangea Plus. Just because um, that messed us up last time. If you watch the Korean playthrough, um, basically I didn't realise that all the city-states were going to be off on islands off the coast. And I didn't really get a coastal city. I mean, I did, but it was blocked by it was blocked by ice on either side. So what in fact I got, instead of access to the sea, I got access to a glorified lake. Which screwed me over a little bit. Anyway, hopefully that won't happen this time. And we'll uh, see where we go. We're going to be playing on standard map size, deity, and standard game pace. So let's get on with things. Oh, one other thing. If you have a look here, everything is normal, you know, nothing, uh, they haven't changed any of the standard settings, so let's go. There you go, now those of you who've watched my other series, you know I'm a great admirer of beards, and Civilization V definitely is the leader in terms of great beards. I don't think there's a game with as many great beards as this, that's for sure. Well, this time we're actually going to be playing one of the few people who don't have a beard, in Wu Zetan, so we'll see how that works out. Let's go. Okay, so... Okay, well, good. We've got salt, which I like. A lot of salt. That's excellent. Um, we're next to mountains and a river, which is cool. Not really great. Well, I suppose, actually, saying that, at least our desert tiles are hills, which is fine, so we build mines on them. Yeah, that's not too bad, actually. We don't have a lot of desert. We've got, yeah, that's a nicely fortified city as well, with mountains on either side. I'm quite, quite pleased with that. Okay, let's build where we are. I like the fact that we've got a ton of salt. I don't like the fact we're right next to some tundra, but... I suppose we'll check out what that means in a bit. Head on to production, but we're not going to do... Uh, there, two gold extra per turn. Very nice. So, scout, monument. Maybe I should get two scouts on a Pangea. Hmm. I think I'm going to get two scouts. I'm going to do things that way. I'll go like that. And we'll go and explore. Uh, okay, so pottery. And then... And then definitely mining, isn't it? Mining is, uh, is what we want. We only need mining for salt. We don't need anything else. So, so mining. And then we're going to want what calendar, animal husbandry. Yeah, okay. So mining first. Then what calendar? No, then animal. No. Yeah, okay. Mining. Yeah, and then calendar. And then we'll probably work out what we want after that. Okay, next turn. See where we're at. Probably won't build a monument. We'll probably wait until we get one through legalism. And we'll see. Baring Crater. Okay, where is it? Okay, over here. Mm, yeah, so so. I wouldn't go out my way to get it, but if there's something nice around there, uh, which, you know, I can, which gives me a justification to build this. Oh, okay, ruins. That's nice. 
don't like we've walked into a big dense forest though that's going to slow down my warriors search for stuff but hey ho and go okay that's that's kind of nice or well, maybe we will build a city there we'll get furs we'll get chocolate yeah maybe we will build a city there on a river yeah maybe I don't know we'll see kind of nice to have a some free science there I don't know. We'll have a look. There's plenty to explore, so... Is there some other great... Oh, there is right all the way over there. Okay, we'll try and get those. If we can. I'm not super confident we'll be able to make it there. Oh, there is a city-state just to the north. We'll... Uh, I'll go to that first, and then we'll see if... We'll swing back around or something like that. Might even send a scout. Oh, we'll send a scout this way first, see what he can see. Uh, go up that way. We might get it. Well, it all depends. We can't see who's over here. There could well be a scout right there from some other civilization who's about to steal it. But we'll cross our fingers. Oh, nice. Good times. Pop up. Okay, so we've still got them. Shame this hill's in the way. It would have been nice if we could have got them next turn, but I suppose we'll have to wait one more turn. Keep our fingers crossed again that no one steals it. Uh, good. Okay, some extra culture. That's really handy considering we're not actually going to be building a monument. So that's worked out in our favour. Always good. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm definitely... Well, we'll see where else there is, but I'm liking that idea of building a city there. Okay, what are we going to get here? Oh, that's a bit shit. All that way for a really crappy ruin. Oh, never mind. So we got our first policy, tradition. Excellent. We've got a population boost, which is good as well. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. Definitely want that salt. When's that going to be done? Two turns, so we'll definitely flip over to that once it's done. And then we shall see where we're at after that. But I am liking all this salt. There's nothing bad about salt. It's probably my favourite luxury resource. Let's see what I... Oh, hello! Not a great beard, but beard nonetheless. Quite a neat beard. Uh, let's go up here. We'll probably swing back round. See what else is down this way. But yeah, I'm, I'm definitely kind of leaning towards the city there. It depends if he spams someone out coming this way. We'll have to play it by ear. Keep exploring. You go north. You come here. So choose production. Okay, so we've done that. I'm not going to build the monument. I'm going to go straight to the shrine. I've got that, so we'll hit into there. And we'll get some wheat as well. That's quite nice. Some wheat abix. Okay. I'm quite happy with that. Next turn. Next turn indeed. See where everything else pans out. I'm quite liking the start so far. I'm quite interested to see how I'm going to mess it up. Ooh. Okay. Oh, and Aluru as well. Okay. All right. Well, that's where my next city's going to be, I think. If we can get it. I think we're definitely going to be trying to get that. But no doubt there's going to be a civilization right there. He's going to take it. But I wouldn't mind that. There's some salt up that way as well. Plenty of good stuff. A lot of mountains around here as well. Okay, so we'll get you first. Where we get? Okay, you upgraded yourself. There's nothing wrong with that. Next turn. Rush you back this way. What Pantheon was founded. Yeah, good. I, I like it when the civs, when uh, enemy civs decide to do that. Okay, so Austria's down there. Good times. Not particularly excited about seeing Austria, but hey ho, luck of the draw. I find them more annoying than anything else. Just her voice grates on me. But she probably thinks the same about me. But I don't really care what she thinks about me, to be honest. Punch her if I could, but I can't. Okay, let's get that. Some gold, okay. Nothing wrong with gold as well. More salt. Uh, let's squeeze you through here. So a lot of tundra down here. I not mind getting that, but I'm not, I'd am not. i much rather get Uluru. Don't actually have access to the sea yet, which is a bit worrisome. I'm going to have to rectify that at some stage. Okay, barbarian camp, uh, city-state. See what else is down there. Okay, some some barbarians. Not nice. Uh, okay, oligarchy. So we've almost got enough to get our monument, which is nice. How many turns do we expand? We're going to expand there. Can't can't you expand there, you stupid city growth? Oh no, we've got that tile as well. Okay, well we've only got two. Um, 
Probably is better to do it that way, just the extra hammer. One less gold, but that's fine, yep. That's better to do it like that. We'll see where we're at next. I probably will work that sugar again once we get the extra population. So we'll keep moving that way. I'll leave you where you are. Who have we got up here? Katmandu. Oh, we're the first to, to discover them as well. Okay, so that's kind of good. That means that no one's over there, I'm guessing. Got a bit of extra faith. And you want, what, to defeat barbarians that are invading your territory? Well, I can't actually see them, so I can't really help you with that at the moment. Okay, you're going to annoy me. So we've got that done. Uh, what do we want to do next? Probably start on a worker, actually, because we don't really have... A granary, yeah, but it's not imperative to build a granary just yet, because there's nothing here. Well, the wheat will come into play, but not yet. So I'll probably start on a worker. There we go, we'll get that worker. I could steal one from somewhere, but there's nowhere that near. I mean, there is Katmandu up there. What does a Katmandu? Meow. Yeah, I love that joke. Never gets boring for me. Okay, let's beat you up. Hopefully we won't lose that worker. It'll annoy, that worry, it'll annoy me. But yeah, if no one's met Katmandu, that should mean that we can, we can get it. Just trying to think where would be the best actual city location to get Uluru. Because I would like to again keep it on the on here. So if we build it here yeah, I think if we build it here that would give us all the salt. We would eventually get the sheep got a river and we would get Uluru although we wouldn't get it instantly but hmm. I think that's probably the best location here. Yeah I think so. Let's keep exploring anyway. Oh look who it is! You fucking throw your cup at me you prick! Hate this chump. Hate him. Hate him with a capital H. Even though I dropped my H's being a uh, good old London boy. But that H is there. It's a capital H, trust me. I think I might actually get beat up if I keep trying to fight him. So I'm going to just drop back a little bit. Maybe heal up a turn or two. Cape Town. Okay, so he's definitely to the north. I um, just kind of want to get that, that next city out quickly. Just to make sure we get that. Hmm. Kind of decent starting location. I'm quite happy on the whole with where we're at. Let's start to swing you. Oh, nice. Okay, a bit of ruins. What do we get? An extra population. That's nice. I don't like to see what I just saw there, though. That cross, uh, that uh, hand axe guy. All right, you heal up for a turn or two, just because I don't want to lose you, stupidly. So we've got that extra population, which I suppose we were going to get pretty soon anyway. Uh, I don't want to work that tile. I'm going to work that tile. Get the extra cash. I know we could get a worker a bit quicker, but... Not in a super rush. No, no, go away. Just, just shut up. Don't even talk to me. Pantheon founded. Go. Okay, so pastures. All right, I'm not too fussed about that. Oh, good. That hand axe didn't decided not to attack me, which is always nice. Budapest. Hello. I definitely want to buddy up with you, Budapest. I'm definitely going to try and beat up these people for you because part of my plan. I'm, I'm quite bad at building units. So, I kind of want this time around to befriend a militaristic city-state so they can build units for me. Well, not build them, but you know what I mean. Bequeath them to me. Is that the right word? Hey, here you go. Here you go, China. Have some stuff. Our scout was bombarded, which is not great, but can we kill him? We can kill him. Excellent. Boom, there we go. Budapest, love me. What's your special unit? How do I find that out? Is it here? All oh, right, isn't that the that's the Korean siege unit? I think. Okay, that's kind of good. Not bad. Can't complain about that that's for sure. Let's keep looking around here. That's all. We got some stone. Don't really care about that. I'd rather the cash. Okay, what else we got up here? Oh, that's annoying that those mountains are actually blocking off Budapest, because it might annoy me to get a uh, caravan there. Hopefully not. Okay, you keep doing what you're doing. Nope. I don't think so. Okay, so... That's quite funny that Venice and Austria are in this, so they'll be competing for all the city-states. Nice to meet you, though. That's a... It's not, it's not a great beard. His beard looks dirty. He looks like a man who doesn't wash a lot. That's all I'd say about him. Even his clothes. I mean, for a rich man, 
dresses like a tramp. What was found in there? Goddess of the hunt. Okay, food camps don't really care. What else have we got to the north? You swing by this way. Okay. Okay, we are going to kind of want to deal with that, but not yet. Next turn. I will accept with you because I don't think that you're going to be sending any kind of force to attack me. I'd be surprised, put it that way. Alright, where are you going to go? You just keep exploring, I suppose. See what else there is. Loads of natural wonders around here. Grand Mesa. Oh, and some more ruins. Excellent. Uh, stone circles. Okay. That would have annoyed me a little bit. No, it's fine. It's fine. I'm, I'm alright with that. I can live with that. I want that one for salt. I don't think anyone else is going to take that just yet. Okay, and I'm right next to Hand Axe Man, who shouldn't be able to kill me. I hope he can't. Excellent, we got sailing, which we completely don't need. Hmm. Uh, you might as well stay there, because it's only one turn, and I'm going to keep you on that, and then I'm going to switch over to these production tiles. So yeah, you can stay on that next turn, because we're going to start the work at the Settler next. No, not yet. Not yet. Not yet, Ethiopia. That's it, Austria. You expand that way. I don't care. Don't expand this way. That would annoy me. Oh, just lost track of where everything is. And oh, that reminds me as well of... Oh, Rome. Okay. Well, hopefully he's far enough away that he's going to leave me alone. I just remembered about my warrior. Okay, so... Where do I want to go to... <sighs> Probably this one. Where's it going to expand next? There. Okay, so yeah, that one, because then I can hook up both of those pretty quickly. Keep looking around here just to make sure there's nothing untoward. And we'll get that settler out. Alright. Off, off, off. Just reset everything. There, there. So we definitely want them and that. And yeah, that, I suppose. That makes the most sense, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay, so nine turns. Nine turns. Still haven't seen anyone spam anything out yet. Another city. So I just want that location there. And then it'll be good times. So teach up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so let's keep exploring. I've not gone into their territory, have I? Now, where was that? There you are. Okay. We'll beat you up, don't worry. Move here. Build me that mine. Get some salt. Okay, so they've built a city down here, have they? I kind of do want access to the sea, but I don't know where I'm going to build that sea city. That's the thing. Could be another game where I don't have real access to the sea. I mean, I could build it here. That would give me access to... Uh, yeah, I would get crabs. And if I build it here... It's not great though, is it? Get tundra... We would actually even get those crabs, actually. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to forego another fucking game without any access to the sea, which is uh, slightly annoying, but I suppose, what can you do? Alright. How much money do we have? Oh, we've got loads of money. We could get an archer, and I do kind of want an archer, so let's let's go... No, let's go writing, and then we will get the archer. Ar no. No, I don't want to delay that anymore. Okay, we'll go that, then we'll get archery. Then we will get animal husbandry. Then we will get the wheel. Oh no, I need calendar. Oh no, I've got calendar. Yeah. Uh, okay, so that's how we're going to do things. We're going to go like that. And we'll see how that pans out. On the whole, I'm liking this start. I'm just disappointed that we're not going to get access to the sea, I don't think. Okay, you need to get your ass down this way because these guys are going to annoy me. You beat up on him. You bombard them. Next turn. Come on. Now ah, that's annoying me. That's going to slow things down a little bit. I suppose there's nothing we can do. Hello. Come over here. You go there. Um, there is quite a lot of flat land. Could be better to go shot. I'm going to go drill though, just because 
I always take drill. <laughs> Bomb you. Next turn. Are we ready? Our archer did take some damage, but hey ho. It's to be expected. Not the end of the world. Excellent. Now we get legalism, so we never had to build that monument anyway, and I don't think we really lost much into. I should have shot him with the archer, actually. Oh, never mind. We'll uh, heal up a turn. Oh! Fuck you! Time to run away. It's really annoying. We'll send that archer down here next turn anyway, and he'll help us smite them. Hopefully. You come up this way. There's a lot of a lot of cool stuff over there for Rome, it must be said. Uh, yeah, you just retreat over here. And I said, I don't want to lose that warrior. Hmm. Come on, hurry up. Build quicker. Where are we? Keep exploring. Oh, shit. Okay, so there's a barbarian brute over there. We'll move you here. Fire at him. Hopefully it won't... Hopefully we'll be all right. A little bit concerned. Uh, well, you're not going to be able to get back in time to help, so just heal up. He's going to annoy me. I don't think he can kill my, my archer, though, right? No, I should be able to bombard him. No, he's dead. He's dead. That's fine. So you keep exploring. Uh, have you done? Yeah, you've built that. Excellent. Okay, so... First off, you finish him off. Excellent. Well done. You come here. Hook that up for me as well. Are you, actually, are you going to be able to hook that up? I don't think I've got mining. You might not actually be able to do that. Oh no, I must have mining because I can do that. Mm, I'm so stupid. Such a dumb dumb. Almost got that second city out. Uh, rather, that, se that, that first uh, settler. That's what I was looking for. That was the word. Good, our guy's been promoted. You build that. Some extra food. You hit that and heal up. Next turn. No, not yet. Oh no, you've got a guy there. I might as well do that, actually. It's a bit pointless, I said. No, oh, what was founded? Sacred Path. Okay, don't care. That's not something that was built for me, anyway. Okay, so we're done here. Let's move this way. We've got that now. We need to switch things around. Stop working that. Okay, what tiles are going to be the best for us to do? Well, certainly all these salt tiles, that's for sure. Uh, yeah, work that. One extra production would be kind of handy, but I think I'd rather the the gold right now. Yeah, okay, that's fine. We will want the granary at some stage, but not at the expense of a paper maker, so we'll get onto that. And um, we're almost done an archery. Once we've got archery, we'll buy an archer. And the next turn. Are we even going to get a fucking pantheon? It might be pointless having a Luru if we can't get one. Fly through here. Uh, you come up this way, just in case. I might need uh, some protection. So where did we say we were going to build it there? So we will get two salt. Uh, we'll get we'll get a bunch of stuff. That'll be fine. Clearing a forest, so we've got a bit of extra production there. Lost a bit of production, though, from getting rid of the forest, but that's fine to upgrade that. Probably need to get some friendship agreements with people. Uh, Austria. Yeah, we'll accept the embassy now. You know where we are anyway, so there we go. That's done. We'll look to get a friendship agreement with you. You come up here. And you... That's the exact tile that I want. It is the exact tile that I want, isn't it? Yeah, that's where I want to build it. Next turn. Okay, let's just go down here again. Let's see where that hand axe is. That hand axe fucked off somewhere. He must have gone exploring the Arctic. Was he? Scott of the Antarctic? Our religion has been founded by Ethiopia. Who else? That's about right. And we will get rid of you. Give us a bit of extra gold. We've got tons of gold. That's good. That's very good indeed. You keep exploring. Uh, you stay where you are for the time. Actually, no, don't stay where you are. Forget that. Explore this way. Oh, there is a barbarian camp right there, isn't there? So just be a bit careful. Found the city there. Excellent. What I'd love to see. Now, how much would it be to buy some tiles to get over there? 80. I wouldn't mind getting a Luru. 110, that's a lot. That would slow us down from getting that archer. But I am going to do it just because I want to get a religion. I'll do it that way. That means we'll get our Pantheon next turn. 
it doesn't actually give us less food or anything like that so we'll do it that way and we will get start working on the paper maker next turn what's expensive but as i said to get that extra six that six faith i think is probably worth it maybe it wasn't i don't know there we go so we got our pantheon which is very nice probably send you back up north you can start bombarding these guys because we're going to want to take care of you. And you want a trade route as well. That's quite handy since you're so near. Uh, right, okay. So what's the one for salt? There is one for salt, isn't there? Uh, I think there's one for salt. If I can find it. Yeah, there we go. So we're going to get loads of faith. Which is excellent. Yeah, tons of faith. Tons and tons of faith. That's 10 faith per turn. That's a lot. Good times. All right, you keep uh, exploring. So that's where Babylon are. Okay, I'm not really going to go any further north, so hopefully they won't get too pissed off with me like they did last time. Next is going to be this way. I kind of do want access to the sea, but it's just going to be a shitty city if I build it there. Hmm, I don't know. I don't know. I'll have to think about it. I've got time. It's the good thing. Time is on our hand. On our side. Time is... We have time on our hands. That's what I was looking for. Uh, Maria's complete Stonehenge. Nice for her. I don't need a Stonehenge because I've got... Uluru! Okay, so you know where I am as well. So we might as well... We might as well say hello to each other. Yeah, there we go. We'll accept an embassy. How about that? Do you want to... No, not demand. I don't want to demand. Do you want to become friends? No, okay. Well, fuck you then. What about you? Do you want to become friends with me? No, alright. Well, fuck you too. So we finished the paper maker. Granary would be good. I suppose. Should we get the granary? I would like the granary, but... Another worker probably seems like what we need first. And we'll get that next worker. And then we'll figure out where we're at after that. And we'll probably get some trade. Or a trade route, rather. Caravan, you know what I mean. And then we'll figure it out from there. You would be nice if you hurry up and get your population up. That would be wonderful. Religion has been founded. Good for them. I should get a religion this time around, I'm pretty sure. Shocked if I didn't. Be kind of annoyed as well. But, uh, stranger things have happened. Bombard you. Good times. You keep exploring. Oh, nice. Nice ruin there. Um, no. Uh, I kind of wish I had a friendship with someone because I want no cash straight up, but I suppose we'll sell it to you. There you go. Me and Ethiopia. Wish Sweden was here. I miss Sweden. My best buddy is Sweden. Get any horses? Any horses? I don't think we got any horses anywhere. No, alright, never mind. Let's go and take that. Oh, hello. There's a city state right there. We'll get that. Excellent, more faith. Like we needed any more faith. A lot of faith. Okay, so we've got that hooked up. Now, we, where are we going to go next? We should probably get that hooked up. There we go for the extra happiness. That's what we're going to do. And we'll keep moving on. Keep on keeping on. Alright, let's just go here to see if we can... Oh, Laventa, hello. Nice to meet you as well. Where did that other... Oh, Theodora. Okay, so two quite powerful religious uh, sieves. They're here. Constantinople is there. Okay, nice to meet you, Constantinople. Was Istanbul, Constantinople. <sighs> ah! I feel like he knows where I am anyway. All right, we'll accept that. What's he going to do? Come declare war on me again? Prick. That's what he is. Prick. Don't let him fool you. He's Prickus Maximus. Uh, you're all pretty good at the moment. Am I going to want to go and build another city over here then? Be quite nicely defended. 
Just trying to think where would be best. Hmm. I might actually leave it. What I was planning on doing is um, recording a couple of episodes, but I think I'm just going to record the first one and then record the next tomorrow, just because I want ideas from you guys as to where to settle uh, second city, third city, and whether I should go for the sea city, even though I don't actually have an awesome location for the sea. I'm kind of thinking here, because that would be kind of good, wouldn't it? Like to get the wine. It would be quite near to Austria, but I would get like a river and a mountain and, you know, a couple of stuff here. Um, I suppose I've got the option here as well. I'd get some chocolate and all that junk. I don't know. We'll have to think about it. Um, you just let's just have a little look what's over here. So there is that other option down that way as well, which I kind of mentioned. Can't really go any further that way, so we'll come back over here, and uh, we'll put an end to this here. So pretty good first episode, I think. We've got space, which is something that sometimes is a bit of a premium space to expand into. So we do have that. Building a city here, even though it would be near to Austria, it's going to be hard for them to do anything with all these mountains in the way. So that's kind of good. Kind of maybe going over here, there's, there's again bonuses to go this way as well. There's furs, chocolate, you know, so that wouldn't be a bad idea as well. Yeah, well, let's see what you think. I mean, by all means, all the usual suspects, you know who you are. Let me know what you think, and uh, I will take your advice on board, and hopefully together we'll be able to win this game. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, hit the like button, and we'll see you tomorrow for episode number two. Bye-bye.